Das ist das ist Ram of Nam. Babala Bubab. Ram Das is my Babala. Well, I think we have to speak in like like who we are. <laughs> That's what I'm doing. I'm a frivolous frivolous flippity gibbet. <laughs> who are you? <laughs> I'm getting too old to be a serious Das anymore. What about you? <laughs> I don't never, 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 never. So how do you understand Maharaji? You asked me, so now I'm returning the favor. How do you understand Maharaji? Understand. What do you mean? Understand. What does Maharaji mean to you? Or what does God mean to you? You choose. At, at first, at first, he was the man, the body. And now he's a cat. <laughs> and um, and then he died. Then he dropped his body. And and um, he was in India. Then he was everywhere. Mainly for my her in my heart. Um, so he's very much like my intuition. I have conversations with him in my um, imagination. Mm -hmm. He's in there too. And and he is he is a soul. He is he is an Atman Atman. He worshipped God and he became God. the sequence. Mm -hmm. So for people perhaps who have not met <coughs> Maharaji who are such a divine guru in the body and form but who encounter him or his picture or his teachings or hear of him or his stories, his inspiration in other ways 
Yeah. Or even in dreams or visions, but generally just hear of him, read about him, see yeah. a picture. <clears throat> How can they come closer to Maharaji and to their higher power, whatever you want to call it, God? How can they, we, they have go through that portal to the place where he's gone and is going? You know, the guru as portal, as door to God and, and higher power. And I ourselves. say, if they're, if they're <clears throat> dreaming or visualizing him, they're already through the portal. He are, he, you, you see, you don't, you don't go after the guru, the guru have, goes after you. And those certain people partly are Maharajis. They're also already um, entangled, yeah. ensnared yeah. Yeah. in the best sense. So didn't he say, or you say, somebody said that you felt like you've been chasing him for a long time, and he said, no, you've been running away, I've just caught, I've been chasing, I finally caught you, something yeah. like that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, I feel like I only met Maharaji really after he took his Mahasamadhi, or in English, died yeah. in 1973, although I was with him in 72, <clears throat> in 73. Um, but I only met him really through the satsang. I was too young then to really meet him, to know him. Is that and, true? And I really got to know him. Is that true? Yeah. I mean, I met him, and he gave me a name, and I enjoyed him. I stayed at his ashram and followed him around. But enchanted, but I really only got to know him since then, over the decades, through the, him, him through the satsang, and also through kirtan and chanting and meditation and dreams and visions, whatever. Yeah. Um, only got to know him since. Uh. Which is his magic, you know, as he's probably yeah. said, wherever two or three are gathered in yeah. my name, yep. there I am. Yep. I think he said that, or someone. Yes. <laughs> he meant it. <laughs> <laughs> he would have said it, would have, could have, should have. But that's an incredible blessing and a joy for me, and a surprise also, which opens me to the bigger, biggest Maharaji, yeah. God, etc. Not just to the man, the Indian person who died or breathed his last, who we can long for and miss. But don't, shouldn't, you know, I don't want to indulge I, in, I can't in missing. Miss him. I like can't, never, the guru I, never dies for the I devotee. Can't, no, yeah. 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 And we're not waiting to go back to India to see him. We're waiting to see him now, like maybe this is his visitation. See him in everyone and everything. Hello, Maharaji. Hello, the Maharaji. Maharaji rule, not just the golden rule. Hello, Maharaji. See Maharaji in everyone and everything, and then who could we harm? Who could we not love? Who could we exploit? We treat everybody as he treated us. which was divine. Another thing is, um, I've, I, don't, I think I've told you this, I never sing, chant, pray without him being right there on his tuck at his seat in front of me, just like he was in Kenshi or Lahabha yeah. in life. Not like I visualize that, just, I mean, I try not to, especially if I'm doing other practices and things, but it just comes because he opened my heart and opened my throat yeah. chakra and taught me to chant and to sing, just like you and Bhagwan Das taught me to chant and to sing. And he's always right there, so that's really his gift or grace to me. And of course I have his picture around and in my wallet and everywhere, but um, that's still the small Maharaji. Yeah. And this is his body and all of us, his heart, mind. Sure, I, I'm, I'm a, a finger of his his consciousness. You too. A finger, a not finger. figment. Fig <laughs> <laughs> a finger. <laughs> Jinx. Okay. Go. You better. You better. Uh, you better go away. Yes. You give me the jow. 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 We're all like God pseudopods. It's great to see you, Babala. Yeah, I love you.
Don't go anywhere. Don't go too far. How's that? <laughs> Oops. All the way and nowhere. Right.